Welcome, fellow travelers, to Quanta Facts, where we venture into the grand cosmic theater to unravel the mysteries of the universe. Today, we embark on an exhilarating expedition through the cosmos, exploring 10 mind-blowing facts about space that will challenge your perception of reality and ignite your imagination. Prepare to be amazed, for the universe, as we know it, is far stranger and more wondrous than we could ever have imagined. Let's begin our journey into the great unknown. Our journey begins with a profound realization. The universe is not static, it's in a constant state of expansion. Imagine a balloon being inflated, with galaxies scattered across its surface. As the balloon expands, so does the distance between these cosmic islands. This discovery, made by Edwin Hubble in 1929, revolutionized our understanding. Hubble's observations revealed that galaxies are receding from us. This is known as Hubble's Law, implying the universe's accelerating expansion. The fabric of space-time is stretching, pushing galaxies apart. Our next stop takes us to the edge of reality, to objects of immense density and gravitational pull so strong that not even light can escape their grasp black holes. These cosmic monsters, born from the death throes of massive stars, warp the fabric of space-time. Imagine space-time as a giant rubber sheet. A massive object like the sun creates a dip in this sheet. Now, imagine an object so dense, it punctures a hole in this sheet. That's a black hole. As we approach a black hole, we encounter time dilation. The stronger the gravitational pull, the slower time flows. Near a black hole, time slows to a crawl. Our cosmic journey now takes us to the edge of what we can see, to the boundary of the observable universe. Imagine standing on the Earth, gazing out into the vast expanse of space. The farthest objects we can see are about 46.5 billion light years away, forming a sphere with Earth at its center. When we observe distant objects, we see them as they were when the light left them. The light from these galaxies has been traveling for billions of years, showing us the early universe. The observable universe is just the portion we can currently see. Beyond this cosmic horizon lies a vast, uncharted territory. Chapter 4. Dark Matter. The Universe's Invisible Hand. Our cosmic exploration now takes us into the realm of the unseen, to a mysterious substance that dominates the universe, yet remains shrouded in secrecy. Dark Matter. This elusive entity doesn't emit, absorb, or reflect light, making it invisible to our telescopes and instruments. So, how do we know it even exists? We infer its presence through its gravitational effects on the visible matter we can see. Galaxies, for instance, rotate much faster than they should based on the gravitational pull of their visible stars and gas. This discrepancy suggests that there must be some unseen matter, some invisible hand, providing the extra gravity to hold these galaxies together. Dark matter doesn't just influence the rotation of galaxies, it shapes the large-scale structure of the universe itself. Despite its prevalence, dark matter remains one of the biggest mysteries in modern cosmology. Chapter 5. Neutron Stars – Cosmic Lighthouses of Extreme Density Our cosmic voyage now takes us to the remnants of stellar explosions, to objects of unimaginable density and extreme physics. Neutron Stars these stellar corpses, born when massive stars exhaust their nuclear fuel and collapse under their own gravity, are among the densest objects in the universe. Imagine squeezing a star more massive than the sun into a sphere the size of a city. That's the incredible density of a neutron star. A teaspoonful of neutron star material would weigh billions of tons, equivalent to the weight of Mount Everest. Neutron stars are not just incredibly dense. They are also incredibly hot and spin at mind-boggling speeds. Some neutron stars, known as pulsars, emit beams of radio waves from their magnetic poles, like cosmic lighthouses. These beams sweep across space as the neutron star rotates, and if Earth happens to be in the path of these beams, we detect them as regular pulses of radio waves, hence the name pulsar. Chapter 6. Rogue Planets. Wanderers in the Void 
Our exploration now takes us beyond the familiar realm of star systems to lonely worlds adrift in the vast emptiness of interstellar space. Rogue planets. These nomadic planets, also known as interstellar planets or orphan planets, wander the galaxy without a parent star to call their own. How do planets become rogues? It's believed that they form in protoplanetary disks around young stars, just like planets in our solar system. However, gravitational interactions with other planets or passing stars can fling these planets out of their stellar nurseries, casting them adrift into the void. These rogue planets, once thought to be rare, are now believed to be incredibly common, perhaps even outnumbering stars in our galaxy. Despite their solitary existence, some rogue planets might not be as lifeless as they seem. Some scientists speculate that rogue planets with large moons or thick atmospheres could retain enough heat from their formation or internal processes to support liquid water beneath their surfaces, potentially harboring life in hidden subsurface oceans. Chapter 7. The Multiverse A Tapestry of Infinite Realities Our journey now takes us beyond the boundaries of our universe to the realm of speculation and mind-bending possibilities. The multiverse. Imagine a reality where our universe is just one of many, like a bubble in a cosmic sea of bubbles, each representing a different universe with its own unique set of physical laws and constants. This is the essence of the multiverse theory. The concept of the multiverse arises from various theories in physics, including cosmology, string theory, and quantum mechanics. These theories suggest that our universe, vast as it is, might not be the only one. Instead, there could be an infinite number of universes, each with its own unique properties, some similar to ours, others vastly different. While the multiverse remains a theoretical concept, it has profound implications for our understanding of reality. Chapter 8 our cosmic quest now takes us back in time to the very beginning, to the faint afterglow of the Big Bang, the Cosmic Microwave Background Radiation, or CMB. This faint, pervasive glow, discovered in 1964, is a relic of the early universe, a snapshot of the cosmos just 380,000 years after the Big Bang. Imagine the universe in its infancy, a hot, dense soup of elementary particles and radiation. As the universe expanded and cooled, these particles combined to form atoms, and the universe became transparent to light. The CMB is the relic radiation from this epoch, stretched and cooled over billions of years to microwave wavelengths. The CMB is not uniform, but contains tiny temperature fluctuations, representing regions of slightly different densities in the early universe. These fluctuations, imprinted on the CMB like a cosmic fingerprint, provide crucial information about the initial conditions of the universe and the processes that led to the formation of galaxies and large-scale structures. Chapter 9. Our cosmic adventure now takes us beyond our solar system to distant stars and the planets that orbit them exoplanets. These alien worlds, once confined to the realm of science fiction, are now being discovered at an astonishing rate, revealing a universe teeming with planetary diversity. Exoplanets come in all shapes and sizes, from gas giants larger than Jupiter to rocky worlds similar in size to Earth. Some orbit their stars in close, scorching orbits, while others circle their stars at frigid distances. The sheer variety of exoplanets discovered so far has challenged our preconceived notions about planetary systems and expanded the possibilities for life beyond Earth. The holy grail of exoplanet research is the discovery of a truly Earth-like world, a planet that orbits within its star's habitable zone, the region around a star where temperatures are just right for liquid water to exist on the surface. Liquid water is considered essential for life as we know it, and its presence on an exoplanet would significantly increase the chances of finding extraterrestrial life. Chapter 10 Our cosmic odyssey now takes us to the end of time, to the ultimate fate of the universe itself. Just as the universe had a beginning, it too will have an end. But the nature of that end is still a topic of much debate and speculation among cosmologists. One possibility is the Big Freeze, 
a scenario in which the universe continues to expand and cool indefinitely. As the universe expands, galaxies will drift farther apart, stars will eventually die out, and the universe will become a cold, dark, and desolate place. Another possibility is the Big Crunch, a scenario in which the universe's expansion eventually reverses, and gravity pulls everything back together in a colossal collapse. In this scenario, the universe would end in a fiery inferno, as all matter and energy are compressed back into an incredibly hot and dense singularity. A third possibility is the Big Rip, a scenario in which the universe's expansion accelerates at an ever-increasing rate, eventually becoming so powerful that it tears apart galaxies, stars, planets, and even atoms themselves. The universe is vast and mysterious, full of wonders beyond our imagination. As we explore further, who knows what other mind-blowing facts await us? If you enjoyed this journey through space, please give us a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to QuantaFacts for more amazing content. We'd love to hear your thoughts, so leave a comment below and let us know which fact blew your mind the most. Your feedback helps us create even better videos. Thanks for watching and stay curious.